Shalom, Kahala Yahawo, Bahasham Yahushai, Bahasham Raka Kadash, double honors unto the apostles and elders of great millstone, peace salutations unto the hopeful elect. Once again, I am Yahwasap, and Lord willing for the Spirit, uh, <clears throat> the Spirit got on me to name this topic tonight. Take heed of this word before it's too late. YouTube restrictions. All right? So the title might sound a little long, but the main, the main, um, Lord willing, the, the main thing that I would like to push tonight is to focus on some of you that might be watching to take heed of this word, all right, that uh, this word meaning the truth of the Bible, the real truth, all right, the truth that's been thought out there, all right, beginning with the great millstone of, of brothers, the, the elders and the apostles and, and other camps. Uh, don't take the, the word of the Most High for granted, all right, because a lot of you do, do take the internet for granted, all right? You take everything else for granted in your lives. And we're living in a time now where, you know, our enemies, all right, uh, beginning with this so-called white man, he's the one that, that runs every single thing. All right, he's getting ready to pull a plug on, on this whole internet real soon. But before he does that, he's going to, you know, before he even does uh, ever decide to pull the whole internet down, right now um, he's just, um, he's trying to ban free speech. All right, he's putting all kind of new restrictions and limitations on, on social platforms like like YouTube, all right, and I had the inspiration, uh, basically, to do this this short lesson tonight. Uh, hopefully, this won't have to be too long. But you know, a couple of days ago, I was watching, you know, uh, a, a a program on YouTube, a YouTuber, all right, one of them popular YouTubers, all right that has a show, all right, a channel that, that deals with, uh, you know, with movie reviews. And aside from that, they, they crack jokes every now and then. And then between those jokes, they, they put out a few, they put out a few curse, uh, cuss words, if you know what I'm saying. All right. And right now, um, that they're feeling a little bit of pressure from from YouTube, you know, where where they're being told not to be careful with, with what they say. You understand what I'm saying? That, that there's certain curse words, if you know what I mean. That uh, YouTube is telling them that that they can't that they can't use anymore. And so the the host of the the main host of the program. Uh, he came out saying this and that, blah blah blah. That he may consider moving to to another another social platform uh, since since YouTube is becoming, you know, according to him, more more and more restrictive. All right, and and I agree on that. All right, and and it's not just him. All right, uh, and from what I've been looking at. It has not just been the, uh, you know, the great millstone prophets and and other brothers that that's that tr that spread that's been spreading this truth on the internet for for nearly twenty years now. All right, uh, YouTube. Um, we all basically know who really runs uh, YouTube. All right, and so they're becoming a lot more restrictive. All right, and they're, they're putting all these 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 new limitations and restrictions out there, uh, for forcing even regular YouTubers, all right, to to consider leaving uh, the platform and and go somewhere else like Patreon or or Twitch, 
all right, a, a few other le less less known uh, social platforms. Uh, YouTube seems to be, of course, the most famous, the most popular one, all right? And as much as they have seen how popular it is, now, now they've been trying to basically get more controlling and not allow, you know, not allow the person, you know, behind the scenes, all right, to express his or herself the same certain way. You know what I'm saying? And so it really wasn't like this. I remember when, when YouTube first came out. When was it? 2005, 2006? Anybody could make a video, uh, any video, they, uh, uh, almost any video they wanted, as long as it wasn't too explicit, right? But but nowadays, now, the things have totally changed, man. All right? So so we, we are heading towards a, a very, um, how should I put it? Um, you know, our, our enemies are pushing for this new world order, man. Uh, uh, a total control. All right? That they, 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 they want... The, this is really their way of, uh, of, of, of having a control over you, all right, and, 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 and putting a ban on so-called free speech, man, all right, where, you know, it's not just brothers that, 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 they're, that they're coming up against, all right, but, but basically any regular YouTuber, all right, that, that you know, can't can express nor even show certain images um, on YouTube uh, no more. You know what I'm saying? Because if 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 you pass if you pass by their guidelines, you know, of course they could they could strike or, or flag your video, or, or or you know or in the worst case scenario, remove the damn channel, man. And that is what that is what they're really. That is what they're really striving to do. That, you know, this is just a, a gradual step towards uh, towards total control, man. All right? Towards them wanting to have total control over you. That's what this great reset and new world order is all about. That, 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 that's where all this is leading to. All right? And if some of you have seen uh, certain movies, all right, with that predictive programming, all right, they, they, they push their agenda and some of their movies, even years before they would actually do and, and proceed with that agenda, man, all right? But the Brothers and Great Millstone will tell you about one movie uh, called 1984, all right? Which which dealt with you know uh but but people just being in a concentration camp man, and not having any right to uh you know to express express his or herself a certain way, all right. The, the, the absolute control, total control, y'all. All right, and 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 I always keep bringing this other uh dystopia movie from from George Lucas that came out in the early 70s and and this was before Star Wars all right he put something out there called THX1138 and what was that really all about for those of you that are already familiar uh, uh, with that movie that you know what it's about all right it, it, it's about uh, you know a, a, a dystopian society where, where you know, in, 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 in this movie that I just mentioned, THX1138, all right, the, the, the subject in prison was not even allowed to read the Bible, man. And this is what they're trying to do in, in real life, to, to ban, to ban the, this whole truth from spreading out, all right? To, to ban the Bible altogether, and basically outlaw the Bible altogether and even outlaw those that 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 utterly uh, preach the Bible, all right, the way it was meant to be preached. 
all right, to spread the, the word and gospel the, as it was really written to be. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and not, not invent your own doctrine. You, you understand? But, but, but the words of, of, of Yahweh Bahashan Yahweh Shai himself, man. So this is what th th this is what the so-called white man is gradually pushing for nowadays, man. Okay, he wants to end free speech and, and and freedom of expression as you know it. So that's why I I I I, I called on, on on the few of you that watch my show, don't keep taking it for granted. All right, and you know what I'm saying. You should not take any other any other brother's channel for granted, all right? Because all, all of this might soon be gone, man. All right, ain't no telling what what major changes lie ahead in this so-called new year, all right? As to as as to as more and as the weeks and, and months of come ahead, man. All right, and I'm coming weeks or months. Ain't no telling. What what major change may, may may come ahead? You understand what I'm saying? So, a lot of you may, may not really uh, uh, bother taking my word for it. All right, but hey, it, it's on you. All right, I just try to I just try to do my part. I try I try to do I try to do the the, the will of the Lord with the best of my ability. All right, and, and it's really him who I'm trying to please, not man. All right, I'm, I try to, and and other brothers, the apostles themselves will tell you the same thing. All right, that that this is not that this is about this is about spreading the 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 word of the of the supreme being. All right, to 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 let the 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 descendants of those ancestors that were the Israelites, the true biblical Israelites, to let them know about their 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 present, all right, their 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 true heritage, and their future, man. All right, a, a, a lot of our people just just don't want to accept that. You understand what I'm saying, and this is why. Uh, the Bible predicts that two thirds of our people will not make it in these last days. That, that they will not be beamed up into the the them spaceships, man, because they refuse to take heed to this truth. They refuse to take heed to this here word. All right, and that's all I'm trying to emphasize, you know, with my little scene show this evening, because you know. A, f a few of you bother watching my shows, but you hey, that's all right. Like I just said, I try I try to please the supreme being, not not anybody else out there. All right, for for those of you that 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 bother to to watch the the content that I put out, you know, good for you, and for and for those of you that don't, oh yeah, all right, good luck then. Good, good luck until until the Most High decides your own fate, and that's it, man. All right. So once again, the topic of of the of of, of tonight's show: take heed of this word before it's too late. YouTube restrictions and those restrictions just might lead to them uh, ultimately removing this truth all together from their platform. That is what they're gradually striving for, all right? That is what they are gradually striving for to, to you know, to basically remove Great Millstone off of YouTube and other brothers, including myself, little yours truly here, off all these platforms. And, and you can't get, you won't be able to have access to any further shows nor 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 preaching of this word, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, man. All right, that 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 is what I'm trying to emphasize this evening. That that is what our enemies are 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 striving for. 
that this is what they want to accomplish, man. All right? And to my understanding, uh, later this month, you know, just for, for, for edification's sake and for, for the rest of you to know as well, later this month, I'm not sure. Yeah, later this month, on, on January 18th, all right, the, the World Economic Forum, the WEF, is going to uphold another, a, another one of their meetings, all right, another one of their gatherings, all right, and, and they're going to discuss what? The, their, their agenda, all right, on how to push their, 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 their coming oppression a, a lot further towards our people, man, all right? Because ultimately what they really want to do is not only ban this truth, but to outlaw it, all right? Call, call brothers, uh, 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 you know, call brothers outlaws and begin to try and, and persecute brothers, man. That, that's, where all, that, that's what all of this is, is leading to, all right? But, but Lord willing, you know, the, 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 the Yahweh, by Shan is, is going to have our backs in these last days, no matter what these devils try to do, man. So without further ado, I'm going to start. I got just three scriptures lined up. So I'm going to start with Isaiah. Let's go to Isaiah, all right? I, I believe I, I got, yeah, I got it handy. Isaiah, the 10th chapter. All right, and that, that that's in the Old Testament. All right, so I'm going to begin with, with that scripture. All right. Isaiah 10. All right. And I'm going to read verses 1 through 3. All right. So just bear with me a moment. Okay. Isaiah, Isaiah 10 and 1 basically, uh, basically the describes, all right, the, 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 how our enemies are plotting in these last days, all right, and what they're trying to achieve, all right, in order for them to try and destroy all of us as a people, man, all right, because they, they know that their time is short. It is it is their time of rulership that's that's running out, all right, and and that 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 tells you right in the book of Revelation, man, all right, Revelation twelve for for he knoweth that he have a short time. This is why they're doing everything that they're doing. So Revelation, uh, Isaiah, Isaiah ten and one, woe unto them that decree. Of righteous decrees, and that right grievousness which they have prescribed. Now the word grievousness is not exactly a, a pretty sounding word, ain't it? Now for edification's sake, let's just look that word grievousness up real quick. All right. G grievousness, of, of course, uh, uh, you, comes from the word grief. All right, the grief. All right. Now, for edification's sake, you, you know, let, let, let's let, let's just look into it. All right, toil, trouble, labor, labor, mischief. All right, that that is what these elite banking families they, they take pride and pleasure. They, they 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 have enjoyed doing a lot of mischief towards our people with, with their different laws and 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 you know they 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 they, they buy their their, their so-called uh, senators all right their so-called politicians and in, in, in Washington all right all all them so-called laws and, and whatever that they write the legislation right it really comes from 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 Rockefeller and, and Rothschild man all right, they're the ones who tell, you know, your, your so-called political leaders what, what what to push out there. All right, 
a so-called legislation, all right, and uh, 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 laws, all right, restrictions, like I've just mentioned on, on YouTube right now, and 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 some other social platforms will, will, will follow, all right, and, and including Instagram, all, all these, uh, all, all this shit that's out there uh, now, uh, TikTok and all of that. That they wanna that they wanna place restrictions and bans on um, all of that, man. All right. So 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 part of so I I just read you part of part of the the definition of the word grievousness. All right. Here goes a few others. All right. Mischief, misery, travail, trouble, sorrow. Grievance, grievousness, iniquity, all right, pain, painful, perverseness, wearisome, wickedness, all right? So all these so-called laws and, and legislations and, and restrictions that, that, they're, that they're currently pushing, it's really wickedness, man, <laughs> all right? It's wickedness, all right. It's wickedness, man. Okay. When, 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 when the, 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 I, I, I think they've already signed into law, all right. They've already, they've already made legislation. If, if, if you know where I'm getting that, that it's okay for Steve to marry John, man, or for Susie to, 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 to marry. Uh, to marry fucking sissy, you understand what I'm saying? All right, that that is an unrighteous decree. All right, and that right grievousness which they have prescribed. All right, so there you go. Verse two: to turn aside the needy from judgment, and to take away the right from the poor. Now, who are the poor Israelites? All right. Okay. When, 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 when. All right. L let me put it this way: the the majority of these so-called white people out there and and the other nations. All right. When, 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 when they think of when they think of poor people. All right. When, when, when they look in, into poverty. All right. And and misery, and all these uh these low level of uh, names all right they 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 instantly hook it up as being synonymous with what so called black people people of color hispanics all right uh, native americans all right that the, the, this whole land once belonged to to the so called indian savages man okay and, and and as more and more white white settlers came, all right, they got pushed aside to reservations. All right, R reservations are, are are really what, all right, areas of land that's not really as rich that 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 hardly produces anything. All right, if I'm not mistaken, I'm like that other part of of the land. That, that they were used to inhabit it, all right? So the, so the so-called pilgrims came, all right, and, and basically stole that, 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 that them commodities off the, off the Native American people. That's why they, they, they live in, in these miserable reservations now, man, all right? So, so who, really, who, really, who really set it up like that, all right? Our enemies did, man, that take away the right from the poor, from the poor of my people, that widows may be their prey and that they may rob the fatherless. There you go. All right. Verse 3, and what will you do in the day of visitation and the desolation which, which shall come from far? So the Most High is asking, he's asking the robber, in this case being the so-called white man, 
uh, the one that, that's currently enjoying uh, all the resources and wealth that he took from us uh, so-called colored people, all right, the, 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 the supreme being, all right, the most high by, by way of his prophet Isaiah, he's almost, he's almost, um, how should I put it? He's almost taunting uh, Esau right here, all right? He's saying, and what will you do in the day of, visita of visitation and in the desolation which shall come from far? Meaning the, the, day, <coughs> the, 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 the day of the Lord's visitation upon this earth, man. Okay, and, and the elite of Esau knows this, man. And they dread that day from coming. All right, and that and that's why they 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 incorporate it into their so-called alien invasion movies like Independence Day. All right, that desolation which which will come from the fourth dimension, man, from from another realm, from the spirit world, so you can understand. All right. It is from, from that dimension that, that the Lord will, will, will wreak havoc on this earth, man. All right? Right now, he's been wreaking havoc by, by these different storms and, you know, uh, tidal waves of floods, all right? And, and whether in, in upstate New York or as far as California, all right? He's only warming up. With with these uh these different weather weather patterns, man. All right, on the day of his visitation, it's all going to be about dark clouds and all that. All right, okay. All right. To whom will you flee? So he's asking Esau, well, where where are you going to flee into? In, into your 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 deep underground military bases that, that you already got set up, all right? He's asking the white man here, to whom will you flee for help, <coughs> all right? And where will you leave your glory? Hey, so there you go, man. The Most High is, is a terrible being, and, and he's got nothing but uh, fierce judgment uh, for Esau and the, and the other nations, man. All right? Everything that, that you've been seeing happening uh, worldwide, it, it's only, you know, it's only the beginning, man. It's only a warm-up, so you can understand. Now, let's go to Psalms 37, all right? I'm going to read a verse off of that, all right? Psalms, the 37th chapter, all right? I'm going to read verse 12. And what does that say? The wicked plotteth against the just and gnasheth upon him. <coughs> Salakia. And gnasheth upon him with his teeth. All right, and these are the times that we're we're living right now. All right, where where the wicked are plotting, man. Okay, I I I just told you about this WEF meeting, World Economic Forum that the, they held one a few months ago, and they're getting ready to uphold yet another one later this month. What what? What's what's that really all about? Plotting against the just, all right, to gnash upon him with his teeth. <clears throat> all right, the wicked plotteth against the just, and gnasheth upon him with his teeth. Verse thirteen: The Lord shall laugh at him, for he seeth that his day is coming. The wicked have drawn out the sword and have bent their bow to cast down the poor and needy and to slay such as be of upright conversation. 
<coughs> their sword shall enter into their own heart, and their balls shall be broken. So there you go. All right? That's what the Most High has set up for our enemies. No matter how good their efforts uh, might pay off in these last days with, with their NWO setup. All right? Now, I'm going to go to Psalms 32 now. All right? Psalms 32, I'm, I'm going to end it with that. All right? Psalms 32 and 7. All right? Psalms 32 and 7. It says this, Thou art my hiding place. Thou shalt preserve me from trouble. All right? Because a, a lot of trouble, Jacob's trouble, is getting ready to unfold in these last days. All right? It might, it might very well be this year. All right? Only Lord knows for certain, but hey, we, we are near. Like it or not, uh, you know, like it or not, uh, you know, we must do our best to be ready. All right? But it says here, Thou art my hiding place. Thou shalt preserve me from trouble. Thou shalt compass me about with psalms of deliverance. Salah. All right? And, 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 and hey, the, the scripture also does say, the the book of Proverbs, if I'm not mistaken, the name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous runneth into it and are safe. All right? So, you know, my, my, my final advice tonight is, you know, for, for, for the little audience that I got that might be watching, you know what I'm saying? Uh, if, if, if you're really serious and, and sincere about this thing, you also need to include prayers. All right? Uh, knowing, knowing that you're an Israelite, knowing this truth and all that is not enough. You got you to gotta pitch in your own effort. <coughs> all right? You got to pitch in your own effort into this thing. All right, that 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 is what that is what the Most High requires of you. All right, you, you gotta you gotta keep prayers up. All right, especially when uh, when you go out there. All right, uh, Psalms one twenty one and Psalms ninety one and one twenty one are, are real good for that. All right, why do you think so many bad things happen? Uh, to so many people, all right. They, they they have they have they have serious accidents and all that because they don't they don't know nor inquire of the Most High, man. They don't they don't ask for his guidance for his protection. That's why a lot of them get caught up in freak accidents, uh, end up dying uh, horribly. All right. A, a, a few days ago, I found out a, 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 a random woman out there. It had to be a so-called white woman. All right, she she got sucked into the the damn uh, the damn engine of a damn airplane, man. You know, she was working at at at, at some airport somewhere, and got sucked in, into the, you know, the the and uh, one one of the airplane's engines, man. That, that's a horrible way to go out. Why, 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 why you think them, them things happen to people like that, man? Because they don't keep prayers up. They, they don't inquire of, of the Lord, man. All right? And, 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 and a lot of these so-called white people, you know, especially them, you know, a lot of them like to say, I don't believe in God and all that. And, and and then there's the Uncle Tom niggers that like to follow. 
You know what I'm saying? And this is why they, they get caught the way they do, and a lot more of them are going to keep getting caught. You know what I'm saying? You got to keep them prayers up and, and, and just but pitch pitch your own effort into this thing. And, 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 if, and if you have more than enough knowledge of the scriptures, you know, to try try teaching others, all right? To try teaching others of your own race and nationality, all right? To also know this truth, man. That's what the Lord re requires, all right? But be, be, be doers of the word and not, not just hearers only. But the book of Matthew, if I'm not mistaken. All right, the the the, hey, the, the most high is a very, uh, you know what I'm saying? You, you, you got to take this truth serious, man. All right, he's a very strict and demanding higher power. And he's getting ready to show that in these last days. And it's important for, for those of us that are already uh, do our best in, in this thing, all right, to continue uh, beam a, a prime shining example, all right, and, and and not look back before him in these last days, man, because because the, those of those that choose to just go their own way, the end, the the end, the, end, the, end, the end, uh, words cannot describe what what the Most High has set up for them, all right. So, hey, with that, you know what I'm saying? I, I hope this, this show was edifying. I, I said I wasn't going to make this too long tonight. All right? So, call Hala Yahawu, Bahashan Yahweh Shai, Bahashan Rakakadash, Shalom.